Oh la da 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 basaka tala ba da da da. Oh la da 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 basaka tala ba da da da. In the name of Jesus, mighty Father, Lord, I bless you once again. I give you glory. I thank you for all the things you have done. I thank you for the miracles. I thank you for the revelations. I thank you for your power. I thank you for your grace that is sufficient. I thank you for the miracles you are doing on the face of the earth. Lord, I am here for a purpose because I know that you have never lied to me. Everything that you have told me, Lord, they have all come to pass. You have never given me a word. And I said it to the whole world and it does not come to pass that way. Lord, I am here today to handle a matter to make sure that this problem is settled once and for all. For I know that in thee I seek for help. In thee I seek for solicitation. I solicit for your grace. I solicit for power that you may step in, O oh God. Father Lord, you have revealed several things to me. When it comes to election in Nigeria, you have always told me things that will happen. And I will prophesy them and they will come to pass. Father, in the last election, you told me all the governors that are going to win the election. And I prophesied them all. They came to pass. You told me everything that is going to happen this year, Lord. Everything has happened. Especially one of the ones that just happened recently. When you told me on the 31st night that the Queen of England is going. That you told me, Lord, that they should pray for her. That is the husband is calling her to come over this year. Lord, you reveal it to me and I prophesied and it come to pass. Lord, a lot of people have been praying and have been asking the problem of this country, Nigeria, that it has to settle, that the people that are the indigenous of this country will know their fate. And Father, this problem has to be settled once and for all. And that is why I'm here to ask a question, Lord. You are the same God that revealed to me about Nam the Kano. You told me that he's coming all the way from abroad to Nigeria and that prophesied that he's coming to Nigeria and I see him right there in Brafra land. Father, it was the revelation you revealed to me. And as the case was going on, oh Lord, a lot of people were confused and I told them not to worry. That the country and everything happening in the country is in the care of the Almighty. And oh Lord, you told me that he will not be killed. That he's going to be alive. Nobody is killed anybody. These are the prophecies that you have revealed to me. Lord, you also revealed to me that there's going to be a settlement in that case. Because there's need for peace to return back to the southeast. Father, there is need for peace to return back to the country. There is need for peace to return back to all over the nation. Father, Lord, that whatever is going to happen, Father, it has to be according to thy will. That if thou will, that we all should be in our separate homes uh, in this country, it will be so. Nobody will say no to that. If thou will, that we remain together. If it is your will, whatever is your will is what I am after. And therefore, Lord, you told me there is going to be peace that the case will be settled. So that this case can be settled, that peace may return back to the Southeast. That the people of Southeast may have peace. And also Nigeria in general may have peace. Lord, that is why I am here right here on this mountain to pray and to ask, oh Lord, is it that you are not the same God that showed me all these things? It is time, Lord, for your hand to stretch out and settle this matter once and for all because I depend on you. I don't have any other thing anywhere. I don't have any other God. I don't put my trust anywhere. You have made me the prophet of nations. You have made me the major prophet of God to prophesy thy will only. That is why, Lord, I am here to. This matter must be settled. Whoever is involved, from the presidency to the grassroots to everybody, let the peace reign. Lord, cause your peace to reign. Let there be peace that peace may return back to the southeast. That this young man may go home and take care of his people in the name of Jesus. This case needs to settle, oh Lord. I don't want the, 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 the continuous case in this country that will be causing a lot of damage and a lot of jeopardizing and a lot of pain to the people. The people are saying shut down. Every day people are now going to uh, uh, sit at home and all of these things. It is not helping the economy of this region. It's not helping anybody. It's not even helping the Nigeria as a state, as a country. Therefore, Lord, I have come as a major prophet to settle this matter. In the mighty name of Jesus. And another case, oh Lord, that I'm here, oh Lord, oh God, Father, our Father. The Lord that never fell. You have revealed everything to me. And I prophesy them, they come to pass. You have also revealed the case of Asu. And you told me that this case must settle. Lord, I have prophesied and I want to know what is going on with the case of Asu. I want to know, is our student going to remain at home? Or is there there's no money? What is causing all this? Lord, I pray this hour. Lord, that you may shake this mountain. That you may shake this mountain. It's a mountain of sorrow must be removed. 
Mountain of pain must be removed. Mountain of delay must be removed. Mountain of hindrance must be removed. That your people all over the world that are watching me wherever they are may have that experience of the power that your spirit has moved in the realm of the spirit to begin to touch them. You begin to release thy grace, the anointing, the glory. Set to this matter once and for all. There are many people, oh Lord, that are believing you for one miracle or the other. A lot of people are believing you for visitation. A lot of people are believing you for encounter. A lot of people are believing you for spiritual touch. Therefore, Lord, release your power. Release your power. Touch them and do something new. Father, I want to hear the testimony that something has happened, that the miracle has taken place, that the case of Namodekano with Nigeria has been settled, that the case of Asu has been settled, that different, different matter that is eating the people down, that is eating everything, must be settled in the name of Jesus. Viewers all over the world, wherever they are, they are watching me right now, wherever they are watching me, Lord, anybody that comes to this channel to watch or to share or to like or to comment for good purpose, that person must go home with the blessing. The hand of the Lord must be stretched to touch that person, that that individual may experience the hand of the Lord and release the power of God from above. The power like the God that was with Moses right on the mountain. When Moses ever goes to the mountain, whenever he gets to the mountain, all the cases of the Israelites have been saved, have been settled. I come to the mountain that the Lord God Almighty, the God of all possibility, the impossibility especially, may do something new, may manifest his power and his glory and his anointing that something new must start immediately. Those that are sick, Lord, I release power of healing to locate them and bring it to bring healing to them. All the sons and daughters of God, all the wafoni in the hand of Jehovah, that you may stretch your hands and begin to touch your people, that all the people that are trusting you for one thing or the other, for one visitation or the other, for one encounter or the other, Lord, that you may stretch your hand and do something. Do something in their lives. Visit them. Cause your glory to be seen. Let your power be seen. Let your hand be seen. The God Asana by fire. I am here for you to do something. I am here for your power to manifest. I am here for you to show something. I am here for you to release the power from above, the anointing from above, the glory from above. This case must settle. Our students are going back to school. The case of Namadi Khan must settle. The world may know that God is God. When you reveal to me about everything happening in UK and I prophesied them here, they all came to pass. When you reveal to me about things happening in Nigeria, and I prophesy them they are coming to pass. These two cases must be settled. Yes, that man of God is watching from East Africa. That man of God from East Africa, Lord, visit him and do a miracle in his ministry. There's somebody also you're watching me. This is where you're watching from the US, United States. You have a case. That case you have with your wife is already settled spiritually. God is at work. Yes, somebody's having a document immigration matter the immigration issue is over la na la na katagada no second tere bodia baragada ra sunde kira rabara every immigration issue the lord have settled it yes lord thank you jesus as men that are watching me wherever you are i don't know whatever the case may be that you are going through but right here on the mountain the lord has spoken to me to tell you that the case is over this case is over by fire this case is over by fire arana makatala da da ba shala da banakada raba ba thank you holy spirit because i know that when you step into action every small demons will run away 
away. Every big demons will run away. Every foul spirit will bow. Every unclean spirit will bow. Lord, step into this case. Remove and replenish. Remove and replace whoever that have vowed that the matter in this country will not settle for good, that the citizens and the people of this country and the indigenous people of this place can decide where they want to be, whoever is standing on the way, and never let the will of God to be done. Remove and replace Thank you, Father. Because I know you have answered the prayer. The Lord has answered by fire. You have answered by fire. Glory and honor be to you. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Ascent of Days. Rana Makantolo Bonzingarada. Rida Glotoko Paradilla Gros Sunta Kada Dada. Rida Katorodo. Shandala Baba Bara. Bara 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 Badunzo. Enzende Kila Bara Takata. Ime Nachineke Onyamara. Ezendieze Udoga China Ha Jesus. Aka Chuku Gewe Rono De. Ie Chuku Dere Ode Woya. Oga bena mezu. Iye chuku kuroku woya oga bena mezu. Eh, raka tala na maradala. So whatever is written is written and it must come to pass. And a songwriter wrote a song and he said, Whatever the Lord has written must come to pass. Whatever the Lord has written must come to pass. Whatever the Lord has written must come to pass. Whatever the Lord has written must come to pass. Iye chuku dero de woyao, iyo kuru geme. 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 Iye chuku dero Wonder ever Lord has written must come to pass. Wonder ever Lord has written must come to pass. Wonder ever Lord has written must come to pass. Thank you, glorious Father.